Council deadlocked overnight on allowing more pot businesses in Denver. The big question here is about caps. Should there be a limit of some kind? Our Sean Chitness live with the story this morning as we keep you covered. Sean? Well, Alan, supporters were arguing those caps were needed because they thought there were too many businesses related to marijuana in their neighborhoods and they wanted to keep kids away from them. But opponents said that this would be unfair to them and those who were trying to open businesses had applications already in the process waiting for a new license. The proposal would have capped the number of licenses for marijuana businesses in some areas. It would also have created zones to keep grow houses at at least 1,000 feet away from schools. Business owners said this would have sent the wrong message about Denver, but supporters argued it was what some communities were demanding. Our neighbors and constituents are upset, um, and they feel like this is now affecting their quality of life. This sends a pretty bad message to business in general. It's risky to invest here. So the vote six to six, a deadlock making the proposal fail. Unclear what supporters can do at this point and if council members will take other steps to try and bring this issue back before the council at another time. Reporting live, Sean Chitness, CBS 4 Morning News. Sean, thank you.